Alrighty, we're back where we left off in the battle. Kid is, like, making a name for herself now killing elves. So, not... She's killed more than just freaking dwarves now. Although, Kid might still have a problem being completely surrounded by elves here. And they're slashing on her, but everything's being deflected by the gauntlets. And they're shooting crossbows and everything at her. But it just doesn't matter. And she's not even tired. Look at that. Let's see the status of everybody. From the bottom up. You're picking up equipment. You're not tired anymore. Great Axe Dwarf, Adequate Shield User, Skilled Armor User, Professional Discipline, Skilled Observer, Grand Master Fighter now. The downside is if Kib keeps having episodes of stupidity, she'll just frickin' murder anyone that she comes up to fight. <laughs> Adequate Axe Dwarf, Dabbling Shield User. You're not actually involved in the fight, which is unfortunate. I'm just checking to see who's... Competent Axe Dwarf. Is that Lorbam? No, nope, Lorbam's back here. It's like two dwarves are doing all the fighting. You might be doing some. We know where Kib is, so where are you? What are you doing up the... Why are you doing individual combat drill? <sighs> you guys are just over there. So literally it's like just a couple of people doing all the fighting. Uh, are you guys dead or what? What's going on with you people? Did someone die? You guys are probably still fighting each other. Faint, haggard. So, you are probably going to die because of just the sheer amount of blood loss. <sighs> if one of you knock pass... If the both of you, that would be the best thing right now is for the both of you to pass out. Seriously. So, Kib is fighting these last elves by herself, getting her honor back, doing a very, very good job. Bash, 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 bash. They're just bashing each other now. Oh, passed out from exhaustion and regained consciousness. That fight's just not gonna stop. Are you finally tired? Oh my god, you're finally tired. 32! <laughs> so one named elf, Tira Skunk Birth, and then 32 other kills. She's killed half the freaking elvish army by herself. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Terrified while in conflict. But you're a golden god. Massive jagged scar. Absolutely inexhaustible, mighty, and agile. My god, this is a wall of text, isn't it? Rarely happy or enthusiastic, so she's never gonna be happier. 
She likes to party and merry make while she's never happy. Motions of others, greedy streak. She doesn't really care about anything anymore, so maybe that'll flatten her mood out a bit. Delusional fantasy. I do like that. <laughs> she sees sacrifices as wasteful and foolish and, she, and doesn't care if others take the time to master a skill. She dreams of crafting a masterwork someday. Is that all the elves? Or is there still more? There's still more, so... Squad B kill from list. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J. Go back down. C, D, E, F, G, H, I, and J. Find the elves and you shall kill them. We don't need the crossbow dwarves anymore. Somebody recover the two wounded. <laughs> Love of God. They must seriously just freaking hate each other. That should end the fight between those two guys, though. They're both overexerted and unconscious. <laughs> In the course of the Battle of the Elves, all those two stupid dwarves could do is beat each other into a bloody pulp and fall unconscious. <laughs> good job. Absolutely good job. So let me guess, you're gonna go rest. No job. Is anyone recovering wounded? Because God knows they need to be recovered. No, everybody's just... No one's picking them up. No one's going to recover them. They're beat to hell. Upper leg is fractured, cut open. Mangled beyond recognition. You need... You need medical attention. You you took you got the bad you did you got the bad end of that. Very slow to heal. Cut open, bruised, broken, broken, mangled beyond recognition. Broken, torn open, broken, broken, cut open, broken. Stomach is fractured. Left hip is bruised. You may not make it. So on occasion people are finding more elves. It is not going well for the elves now. There's only two elves left. Wow. So, Kib has regained her honor. I'd say. Sad. You can't do that there. Forty three kills. Wow. All the notable ones are, dwar are dwarfs, of course. There should be one elf. No, there's no noticeable elves. Not in that list. And then 32 elves just straight up murder. Endurance and strength. Everything else is alright. Disease resistance is terrible. 
Recuperation is fucking god awful. Look at that, six. I don't know why you want ammo. So you now have. 25. I don't know, lots of elf kills. Woohoo! And now, who's fighting? And why? I guess the elf recruit, recruit was just found, and that didn't last very long. That did not last very long at all. Is there any elves left? No. I would say you guys have finished. You're probably tired? And you all should get some rest. Wee Military alerts inactive. Are they just leaving that one guy up there? Probably did. Why is the miner throwing a tantrum? Someone put the bed back in the hospital. <laughs> Health. No evaluated wounds. Someone's recovering some wounded. Diagnose patient, recover wounded, so good. We need to go back to labors. And we need to make sure that everybody is doing the doctoring things. Very good. Where's the miner throwing a tantrum? He's over there. Oh, you're you're gonna kill this guy. Why are you? Oh no, he's not gonna die. He's just throwing a tantrum. So we got you stumbling around obliviously. We got you. Over here, throwing a tantrum. I am more scared of you throwing a tantrum. Because you're a miner with a pick. Who appears to be heading straight for... Where are you going? The medical room? Nope, you're just running up and down the stairs, screaming. And someone, of course, has an idea. The siege engineer. Lovely. Well, the people of this fortress will be some of the hardest motherfuckers to exist in the world. We got loads of dead bodies. Everybody's running out to collect stuff. We'll, we'll reclaim everything in a little bit. The thing is, we should... The water down here should be low enough that it's not, like, the biggest issue anymore. You ran around to punch one dude, ran down, punched the peasant, and you're happy. A dwarf has claimed a workshop. <laughs> okay. So, Quarry, you want stone. Square blocks. S some leather. Shining bars of metal. Square blocks. Skeletons. A quarry. Square blocks. Stacked leather. Shining bars of metal. Square blocks. Okay, so we'll get something interesting. Skeletons, so you want bones. 
Uh, what we're gonna do is jump cut for a while until this guy is done, maybe? Well, let's let's see what his base is. What is going to be your base? You're running upstairs. Oh, you're gonna grab bones first. So your base is going to be rat bones. And on that note, jump cut. Hello, we are back. Why are we back? Well, the artifact is not done yet. But we're back because this guy. This is one of the two guys that were beating up each other. The two crossbow dwarves that were beating each other up. He's gonna die. He's got multiple infections. But look at this list. Infection, 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 and oh my god, it goes on! He is completely infected. No. Oh, there's a lot of sutures. Okay. So, yeah. <laughs> Like, that is a long, long list of just injuries. Look at that. So many wounds, because those two just beat each other the fuck up. Some of them have been treated, but I don't think that this guy is going to... I don't think he's going to survive. I just don't think he's going to survive. I think he's dead. What's your condition? You're the other person that's beating each other up. So, I think they're both going to die due to infections. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, there we go. There we go. Yep, 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 yep. Infected as well. They're gonna die. Wow. <sighs> well. Such is life. Jump cut. Oh. There's a funny thing I just noticed. This is Kid. The one with all the kills. Who now has over 40 kills. Kib's a butcher. <laughs> Kib is actually profession butcher. Yep. Go figure. Go figure. Oh, she's got an infection. Probably gonna die now. Hmm. Oh well. What are you gonna do? Probably gonna die. <clears throat> Alrighty, hello everybody. So we're back. Uh, we got a forgotten beast. Who isn't particularly dangerous except for that it breathes fire. So that we've got to take care of. Which means we need to assemble the arch dwarves, the crossbow dwarves, again. It also means that uh, military alert time. All sieves inside. Loads of stuff on my desk. Okay. And also we need the melee squad in position. So where is that one dwarf slayer? Kib. Kib, 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 kib. Stra a steel battle axe strapped 
to the body. It doesn't list any dwarf kills. That's interesting. Just wanted to check that. Okay. So everybody should be called up now. The guy doing the artifact is broken. Oh, you're one of the melee guys. You're stumbling obliviously, so... <clears throat> Are those two still fighting each other? No, it doesn't appear to be so. So this guy is already making a run for the fortress. Which really did not take long. Really did not. Okay, and our crossbow dwarves are also in position, so that really did not take long. Our dwarves are reacting very quickly this time, which is very nice. The question is, do these guys have ammunition? Mm, quiver... That guy does. Not a lot of ammunition, but he's got some. Where's your quiver? High boot, glove, shoe, socks, quiver. 25 silver bolts. You got lots of stuff sewn into you. All your stitches are still there. Your quiver. No ammunition. So you got no ammunition. Quiver. Eight copper bolts. Not a lot, but you got some. Your quiver. Eight steel bolts, not a lot, but some. Um, where's your quiver? You're an idiot. This guy is an idiot. He's not even armed. Oh, that's... Yeah, there's a reason that he's not armed. He's a farmer! <laughs> he's hauling shit. Get out of there. Oh boy, you're slow. Why are you so slow? Your ankle's broke. Oh, boy. You might be in trouble there. So you, do you guys have ammunition? You're haggard. I see the cats come back to join me again, which means I'm going to have to throw off the desk. Yep, you have your quiver. What about you? Are you and you have ammunition as well? Very good. I hope you can get out of the way. Uh oh. Oh, the mechanic there is dead. Uh, I hope the mechanic's not important. Obok. He's alive for the moment. So we're looking to Dwarf Fortress. That is a familiar name, so he might be important. But he's a mechanic, so it's not like he can be overly important. Obok. Uh, this guy's a legend for some reason. Oh, woodcrafting. You're a kid. Seven years old. Already a legendary in woodcrafting. You kind of suck. Obek what? Oh. That Obek is dead. Oh well. Obek bought this other guy a little bit of extra time. Will it be enough? A Zephon. 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 Zephon, thank you. He is our level 8 weaver. Highest moodable skill. And the caves are now on fire. Holy cow! There is a tantrum happening! Why is the Marks Dwarf throwing a tantrum now? 
in there. And the caves are on fire. No, don't leave. Don't leave. You fools. You have ammo. I hope. No, you don't. You do. You do. So that will literally leave that guy. Okay, they see him. They're gonna fire. They, of course, miss. Boom! He's hit. In the head, but doesn't kill it. B. You guys must kill this. Boom. You all have shields. You know what to do. Go! Okay. Right front leg, fracturing the bone, right rear hoof, right... Well, tearing the bustle, fracturing the bone. Artery's been opened, charges at the axe dwarf, jumps away. Okay, so the, that Axe Dwarf has blocked the fire. The mechanic is very much dead. Kicked him in the head. So who's on fire? Anybody on fire? No. You've been hit, haven't you? Didn't feel anything after seeing an elf's dead body. <laughs> Lots of many times. Yep, broken. You're in pain. Ooh, you must have been hit. Militia captain. How are you so badly wounded? Sure asked. Hammer dwarf. Hmm. I don't know why you're so badly hurt. No, you're going... An archer dwarf is, of course, insisting on going to melee, melee range. Okay, so now they're hacking it to death. It's forgotten. Oh, fallen over. Oh, the militia captain's gotten back involved in it again. So they're really hacking this forgotten beast away now. Left front leg, hacks the forgotten beast in the right rear hoof, artery's been opened. In the neck, tearing the upper spine's nervous tissue, very good. Forgotten beast. You're winded already. Guts, upper spine. It is only a moment of a matter of time now that you die. Oof. Ooh, bruising the muscle. She jumps away. Bruising the guts, axe dwarf hacks, tearing muscle. Tearing apart muscle, artery has been opened, motor nerve has been severed. Right front leg with the steel battle axe, Moshe Captain bashes the beast in the neck again. Tearing the muscle tissue now. He's been bit in the upper left arm, but it only bruised through the, the steel mail shirt, which is why you have those. Right rear hoof, it's lost a leg. Right front leg. Yeah, 
This is not ending particularly well for that forgotten beast. Right rear hoof, right mandible. I don't know why it's got a right and left mandible. <laughs> of course the militia captain bites him. <clears throat> Upper body fracturing the middle spine's bone. His back is broken. Granted, it's already kind of finished. Because it's broken at the neck. Now what's over here burning? Yeah, I see the clothing is burning up. Molten lead. So all those things there are burning away in the fire. And this fire might spread. Oh. <laughs> that fire is going to spread. We can shut the alert off. Okay. Bruising the guts. Forgotten bre beast breathes fire, but it didn't do much of anything. Which is good. So who had to dodge it? Blocks the fire. The thing that I don't like is these people are just running into the fire. And that's going to catch them on fire. And if, if this guy thought he was haggard now, he's going to have a whole new level of haggard shortly. So let's see. Forgotten Beast... Tearing apart the muscle, many nerves have been severed. Injured part is cloven asunder. Right rear hoof. It's being killed. It's pale, it's winded, it's losing blood. There's a long list of injuries. Suppose it's dead. It is now dead. So let's go back. This is kind of where I wanted to be. P. Y. Corpses. Hopefully they'll move that up there and it can be butchered when it gets into range. Because you know what that is? That's going to be a lot of useful material. So everybody's done, and those guys are running into the fire. Or did they decide to not do that? They decided not to. Lovely. Is there a fire here? There's smoke. Right rear hoof. Mutilated corpse. There's just smoke. But there's no fire, so... That's good. What we do have now is a great big fire in the cave. And that, a C, is going to burn for a while. The mechanic has been found dead and very much burned. Are you guys going to run through the fire? You are. No, they didn't. Is the cat? Is the cat going to be that dumb? Nope. Even the cat's not that stupid. Ooh, looked like that guy might have been for a second. 
So this guy's body is going to be over here somewhere. There he is. Lead. Well, what's left of his body? There's not much of it left. It's, they're literally just going to be able to bury the dude's hand. Because there ain't shit left. Mebzus carcass is still down there. So, our caves are now on fire. This could be interesting. I guess we'll just have to see how big this gets. But, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. And there goes the tantrums again. Adios. That guy doesn't sound happy. Oh, it's Kib throwing a tantrum! Oh no! <laughs> it's Kib throwing the tantrum. Oh boy. That is now a more dangerous thing than just... The Forgotten Beast. It's Kib throwing a tantrum. Where's Kib? Kib, Kib, where are you? There's Kib. Uh-oh. And he's running. Oh, he's not throwing attention anymore. Or she. She's not throwing attention anymore. She's running off to eat. Thank God. Okay, now this is going to be the end of the episode before anything else dumb happens. And look, the cave's on fire. See ya. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you all for watching my video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed it. Also, don't forget to hit that stupid little bell thing that YouTube has added, because otherwise you won't get notifications of any new videos if you su subscribe. Also, follow me on Twitter, at GenJeft, as I always have my video updates on there, so you will never miss a video if you're on my Twitter feed, because they'll all be posted. And any other dumbass comment I make as well. So, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.